Hello, welcome to this uh, new tutorial. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to create a sort decoding encoding effect in After Effects, which you can use for, I don't know, something matrixed, something, maybe. I'm not sure. Well, yeah, pretty easy. It uses uh, letters from the uh, alphabet to create the actual word, Dumpty, Dumpty in this case. No idea why I chose Humpty Dumpty. Because I like it. But yeah. Well, uh, that's everything. So, let's start off. Create a new comp. About 10 so seconds long. And width, height, frame rate doesn't really matter. Alright, in the new comp, create a new solid by pressing Ctrl Y. Black solid. Alright, press Ctrl T and type the word you want. Uh, the word. Let's keep it simple. In the effects and presets, search for decoder, fade in, apply it to the word. I don't think, no. Alright, pull this one down. Animator 1 and let me see where did I do that? Uh, okay, hang on. Alright, so I press U and then yeah, it brought up the keyframes for uh, the animation select the last keyframe move it uh, about 9 seconds or something uh, go into the advanced tab go to the based on well, characters, characters, excluding spaces and select words and there you go that is everything that's to it and just render it out and everything I'm not sure where you can use this for of or anything but yeah let me just show you how to render everything out uh, go to composition add to render Way. Uh, just check everything. At least that's what I always do. Output mode, AVI, blah 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 blah. Alright, by output 2 you can select the save path. For example, decoder. And just hit the render button and it should render. Well, I think under one minute. And let me just show you the other one too. The the encoder. The encoder fade out. Same here. Create a new solid by pressing Control Y. Create create your text with Control T. Drop the encoder on it, and you will see it immediately starts encoding. But we don't wanna, so press U on the keyboard. Take the first keyframe, move to three seconds, and move this one all the way back. Now you get to see the word, and it starts fading away in a weird way and you can also select uh, here you can go to the advanced tab select words instead of characters and spaces it starts fading out way weirder but hope you enjoyed it hope this was useful and I'll see you in the next one